Hello everyone, welcome to the YouTube channel Mission Net Physics Exam. And guys, today in this new video under the Toppers Track series, we are going to discuss one question. And not just one question, I'm going to provide you some ideas related to this question. Because guys, if you want to do good in this exam, if you want to solve most of the questions in the exam, it's not uh, like you just need to memorize the formula, you just need to prepare the topics. No, along with all those things, it's also very important that you also need to focus on the rest of the things during your preparation. Now, what are these other things? What are these other very important points? Like one point is the approach to solve any question. Is this going to remain same always? No. Do we always need to consider one particular question in the same manner as we consider all the other questions or other questions? No. There will be different ways and depending on the type of question, we just need to think to get the answer for the given question. Now we are mainly going to talk about this thing, this point in this video. As you know, under this series that is Topper's Track, I am going to provide you the videos for all the subjects we are having for our upcoming CSIR Net Physics exam preparation. Along with that guys, I will discuss tricks, concepts, ideas and many important points whatever you need to know to do well in this exam, to uh, get good results in this exam. So yeah, this is also a part of your preparation. Now let's have a look at this question. This has been asked in the CSR and Net Physics exam in previous years. Clear? Now what exactly we are going to learn from this question and on this point which I am going to explain with the help of this question, everybody needs to focus. Everybody needs to think on this thing like, okay, there is also one more way of thinking and relating the concepts in the question. Okay, so let's talk about it. In this question guys, what is given and what we need to find. If there is any student who is just dependent or who just thinks like, okay, whatever thing I need to find, I just need to find by using the formula or that topic should be clear to me if something, some words are there. Then if such, uh, like some student will read this question, who is going to think in the exactly same manner as I have told you, so after reading it or after just reading first two statements, clear first two lines, he or she will think like, oh, this is going to talk about something different. If he or she has not prepared the topic that is superconducting and normal states together and they have not done the comparison between both. So they may think like it's different. But if any student is going to read it or just going to focus on each and every statement equally, and going to understand what is important in the question, what is not important, what exactly they are asking us to find. So after focusing on all these things, he or she will be able to solve the question very easily. Now let's talk about it. The question is, the free energy difference between the superconducting and the normal states of a material is given by this. So this is what the free energy difference for both the states. Clear? Next. Where psi is an ordered parameter and alpha and beta are constants, such that alpha is greater than zero in normal and alpha is less than zero in the superconducting state, while beta is greater than zero always. Minimum values of del f is what? Here, so what they are asking us to find minimum value of del f. Del f, which is exactly given in the question, they are asking us to find its minimum value. Clear? So guys, now, what is maximum and minima concept we all know? So first thing we need to check where the maximum and minima can exist. Okay, now see the steps. They are not related to superconducting state or the normal state. They are related to a general, general, very general concept. Okay, which I am going to apply here now. And I am going to provide you the idea about the steps. So step number one, find the equilibrium points where there are chances that you can get the maximum or minima. Clear. So del over uh, del del theta f over del sine because f del f is a function of sine. So with respect to what parameter you will do the differentiation with respect to sine. After doing this differentiation and after equating it with zero, get the value of sine. In this case, if we get the value of sine square, it becomes convenient for us to follow the further steps of calculation because everywhere you can see sine square is like you can make that term. 
so it becomes simple and easy but normally what we need to do we need to find sine from here but in this question if you want and if you find it okay okay for doing the calculation in further steps you can even just find the sine square but it depends on you otherwise the exact step says find sine after finding the values of sine you need to check you may get two values of sine from here okay two different values you need to check that on what value of sine the second order derivative of free energy not just free energy this is also for delta f then so second order derivative of delta f for what value of sine which you have got from here is greater than 0 because greater than 0 condition tells us the minimum okay and at that value of sine what you need to do you need to find the value of delta f so after finding this value you are reaching to your final answer now what do you need to do you need to take these steps and get the final answer and in this video uh, below this video you can comment about the option which is correct according to you now what we have learned from this question that it is not only about formulae it is not only about the exact topic sometimes the questions may just need you to be a little smart and to focus on the statements rather than the uh, words present in that question clear so i hope you are getting that point done and yeah in the exam even you should be ready to solve such kind of questions okay and if you will be ready with all these ideas all these points you will not face difficulty in the exam in solving the new questions which you will get in front of you in the exam directly so thank you very much everyone for watching this video till the end find the final answer just mention it in the comments i will let you know whether your answer is right or wrong okay now one more very important information guys if you want to get the guidance by the top educators we are having on an academy plus for your exam preparation and you want to prepare very well by getting the guidance by the top educators so guys you can also take the an academy plus subscription after taking the subscription you will be able to attend the live classes by the top educators we are having on Anakad B plus for your exam preparation. Also guys whenever you will take the subscription use the referral code Anjali Arora. No space in between write it together apply it and get the 10% discount in the total Anakad B plus subscription amount. One more thing guys after taking the Anakad B plus subscription you will get the benefits like weekly quizzes, doubt clearing sessions, mock tests, pdf of important notes and the guidance by the top educators. Also guys, to take the Unacademy Plus subscription, download the Unacademy Learning app, log into the app, select your goal. After selecting your goal, that will be CSR UGC Net. If you are preparing for CSR Net exam, after that, click on the three lines present in the left hand side corner, then click on plus, then click on get subscription and follow the further steps. And that's how by following the further steps, you will be able to take the Unacademy Plus subscription. There are so many new Unacademy Plus courses going to start soon. So if you want to take the subscription, you can take the Unacademy Plus subscription and you can get so many benefits. Uh, you can do the best preparation for your exam. So thank you very much everyone for watching this video till the end. Also, if you are new on this channel, subscribe the channel, click on the bell icon and watch all the videos which I am going to provide you in this series because I provide you the topics, tricks, questions and concepts and some very important ideas in the series that is toppers track clear so watch all the videos if you have not watched rest of the videos i have provided you before this one and to watch the new videos subscribe the channel click on the bell icon so that uh, whenever i will upload the new video you will get the notification for that and you will quickly be able to watch it so guys thank you very much uh, for watching this video till then thank you